What's going on, everybody? Eric Johnson with ResignWithUs.com, also Resign Radio. And what else? Also, you can catch me on Twitter at uh, Resign With Us and hit me up on Facebook as well. Um, backslash Resign With Us. Anyway, people have been asking me to chime in on the whole Twitter, I'm sorry, on the whole Sierra and future issue, basically, and I'm paraphrasing Twitter. Uh, I keep saying Twitter. I can't get my, my verbals together. Future went on Twitter, and he went in on Sierra, basically indicating that she's not allowing him to see baby Future, or she's not allowing him to get the visitation that he would desirably want to see his, his son. And he's upset about that, and in so many words, he called her a bitch. I believe he did say bitch, and went on a bit of a rant. And people want me to chime in and give my perspective on what what I see. Well, number one, if I'm if Future's my buddy, or you know, if if, if we're homies, I would tell Future, you probably don't want to go on Twitter and emotionally talk or call your baby mama a bitch it's probably not a good look because number one it's emotional in my opinion it's not what men do you don't you don't do those kinds of things you don't do that you got to also take into and take into consideration future that you have multiple kids with multiple women which means that you're not marriage material at least that's the perception that that's been given to me. You don't come off as a man that is marriage material. You slept with Sierra and you did the exact same thing you did to the other other baby mamas. You you basically, you know, you bust up in her, gave her a kid and now this is what she's doing to you as a result of um, the issues that you guys have formulated in the relationship that was created prior. So, to me, kind of, what do you, what, what do you expect? So, to me, future just needs to go to court. You know, talk about you know what's happening. I believe he's paying her fifteen k a month, and he needs to let the judge know that, hey, I'm trying to, or his, his his attorneys can let the judge know, hey, you know, he's trying to see his child. She's, you know, denying him, you know, the access that he would like or what have you, and you'd be surprised what could happen. But nonetheless, I, I'm, I'm assuming that this has not taken place. But anyway, that that's what I would tell Future. Fall back, handle it through the legal system. That's what she would do to you. She would go through the legal system and she would jam you up, you need to go to the legal system as well and do the exact same thing and handle your business like a professional for once. With the whole Sierra thing, to me, when I look at a woman like Sierra, she, to me, has contributed to the whole thought culture. That's just my opinion. She's a woman that slept with the man, who had multiple kids already, who is already showing you what he's about, and you're showing us what you're about. You'll he, he bust up in you, and now you have a kid as a result, and now you want to utilize or use that kid as a bargaining chip. You want to use your kid as a bargaining chip for power, which is to me just unacceptable. Why would you want to keep your child from his father who wants to see his son? Why do you want to play that game? Just because you're upset because of the way he feels about you? And again, I don't, I'm not co-signing on the fact that he called you a bitch, as I just said before. But the reality is, is that you shouldn't, you shouldn't do that. You should keep this man from his son. And then I look at a guy like Russell Wilson, and if I'm a Russell Wilson, I'm looking at her like, 
I don't know if I would want to be, I don't know if we should continue in a relationship because what's going to happen when we have a kid or if, if I have kids with you, what kind of mother are you going to be to my kids? Are you going to keep, or are we going to get into a, we get into an argument and we have a disagreement and then you leave me, take me for, you know, uh, 30 racks a month and keep me away from my kids. Is, is that kind of what you're on? Are you kind of on a money hunt? Because that's the kind of perception that I get. And people, I'm all for marriage. I believe in marriage. I think um, marriage is a virtuous thing. But I think some, some of you guys need to think about some of the women that you lay up with. And then some of you women, you need to look at your situation and say, is this the kind of guy that I want to get involved with, given his previous track record? What is that saying about me? And like I said to me, Sierra is contributing to thought culture. That's just my opinion. She's contributing to thought culture. I, I, I wouldn't want to be with a woman like Sierra. That's just my personal opinion. And I know people are like, well, you don't even know her. You don't know her like that. She could be a good person. She people can change. So, yeah, I, 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 I get you and I hear you. But I'm just saying, me personally, that's not somebody that I would want to be with, given the fact that, number one, you're denying a man access or you want to play games with a kid. And then, you know, the fact that you slept with this rapper who had multiple kids, just, just to me. And then you're in the entertainment business and they kind of just do whatever. I, that's just not the kind of woman I would want to be with. That's just my personal opinion. Okay. So those are my thoughts. Like I said before, go to my page, resignwithus.com. Make sure that you subscribe to my page. Go go there. Check out the, the latest articles on Black America, on articles on empowerment, black empowerment, economic empowerment, health, and relationships. Also, you guys can check me out on Resign Radio. And then also make sure you hit me up on Twitter at Resign With Us and also on Facebook backslash Resign With Us. You guys take it easy. Peace.